That's a pretty creepy smile, not gonna lie. <laughs> a body may influence a soul just as a soul can shape a body. Just look at the child. Every day he becomes more and more human. Do you have any idea at all why I put so much effort into raising him as a human being? It's because I... Okay, what was that? I think he said the word Lambda. It's what he called that little kid. Emerald. Is Lambda... human? Yeah, please tell us. Of course not. He is a monster that infects and feeds off other life forms. Just like a parasite. So perhaps Richard has been infected. Does that mean we have to fight Richard in order to defeat Lambda? Obviously. No, that can't be. Sophie, are you okay? Perhaps that's as far as it can go. Is she still sick? Some minor data confusion remains, but it is nothing to worry about. I must destroy Lambda. But Lambda is... Has Bell tell me, what is Lambda? Well, how do I explain this? Protos Hayes, you exist to destroy Lambda. This is your sole reason for existence. The form Lambda takes makes no difference. This time, you must destroy it no matter what the cost. Wait, hold on. Sophie doesn't want to fight Lambda because of Richard. I share the same sentiment. We all do. Emerald, there must be something you can do. I guess not. We aren't sure that Richard has been taken over completely. Which means we can't give up. Yeah, and it might be possible to communicate with Lambda too. It's way too soon to give up. Are you planning to parlay with Lambda? Not just Lambda. Richard, too. Asbel. This is a problem that affects all of us, Sophie. We got into this together, and we'll solve it together. Together as one. Wait, what's happening? Our power is resonating. Oh, right, that. What does that mean? Your powers come from me. I am your source. That's how you saved us before, right? By sharing your power. No. It's you who saved me. You gave me the power to change who I was. So you saved our lives. And then we managed to save you. This light connects us together. Wow, okay. Now I'm super jealous. Indeed. <laughs> Pascal, Captain. Ah, uh, don't worry about it. Let's just get back home, smash that cocoon, and find Richard. I'm afraid that even the power of Protos Haste will not be enough to breach the cocoon. Oh, come on. There's got to be a way. Well, I suppose you could reinforce your shuttle and then attempt to break through. Then let's do that. We need a specific attachment to break through the cocoon. But it's available only at a military facility known as Bathurst Citadel. Assuming you can find it, we can make the necessary repairs. Is the Citadel far from here? All right then, we have our plan. We can stop at the Citadel on our way back to tell us as to. Perfect, let's go. Okay, cool. Oh, now we got Sophie back. I know. Yes, let's go. I'm adding her immediately to the party. Gauntlet. Oh, I love Gauntlet Blitz. Yo, best art for Sophie. I love it. Because most of her arts are good, but they're like a little lacking, I feel. I love Gauntlet Blitz. Um, let's take out Asbel. He's done good. He's done great. Good. <laughs> Am I okay? Okay. Anyway, I'm just going to see if I can get out of here. All right, we have to go to Bathurst Citadel, right? Bathurst Citadel is, um, in re that's when we're going to go to Region 66. So I think what we're going to do is go to Region 66, find the, 
the Ember quest that we have to do, and then we'll go back to Telus Askew. And then we'll um, head to Bathysil, though. Because I want to turn in the Ember quest for the SP and stuff. Oh, okay. Yeah, stun me. I just want to say, I want I didn't want to interrupt the cutscene. This game is cheesy. Like, you can argue that. It is cheesy and cliche, but I love it. I don't care how cheesy it is. Because these characters, I just love them so much. And the story doesn't exactly do it for me, like, a lot. What really makes me interested in the story is the characters. Like, the characters are what make me invested in the story. If these characters weren't as good as they are, then this story would not do it for me. I'd be bored. Also, gameplay, but that's a completely different depart department, in my opinion. Do I have any new art for Sophie? I do not. Just, um... Same stuff. Oh, I got Invigoration. Actually, I kind of want that. Invigoration heals, um, everyone. Oh, and Booster Creates Defense. That's pretty useful. Oh my god, I love these victory quotes. Sometimes they're just like, oh, what? Like, I don't understand them, but they're so funny the way they're executed. Also, Sophie is so adorable. Alright, going back is going to be a bit of a pain, but I think I got it. Well, well. In an in request, I think in the humanoid center there was something that for the for an in request, but um, region 66 has one. I'd rather do that and then go back to Telus Askew just so I can get both of them at the same time. Oh, wait, that's not the way out. So, Bath is Citadel. After that, we are pretty close to finishing Bodra. But then we have like one more thing. I think it's part of the Fodra arc. It would make sense if it is. Don't push yourself, Sophie. We just got you back, you know. I'll be careful. If you feel faint, just have Asbel carry you again, even if he's not very good at it. Ooh, got him. Just make sure you don't drop her. Oh. Oh my God. Man, sharing that power must be what makes them so close. I think there's more to it than that. I wish I had magical powers. Hey, Sophie, can you make it so the captain and me are all zippy zappy like you guys? I don't think so. Oh, nuts. We may learn something that can help you at Bathos Citadel. For seriously? Indeed. It was our main research center regarding the abilities of Proto's Haze. Oh, heck yeah! Come on, guys, let's go! Oh, okay. They bolt like Asbel, like, oh, you suck at carrying her. And the Hubert's like, don't drop her. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. Okay. Region 66 is this way. It's like south of where the shuttle. Yeah, see, the shuttle's gone. As you can see. But the save point's still here, so I'm gonna use that. Another thing I mentioned on Twitter, but I'm gonna mention it here too. Persona 5 The Royal, I'm definitely gonna stream the game. It may not be on the release date. Honestly, I can't really say when. Well, first of all, we have to see how this coronavirus thing hopefully doesn't affect the FF7 remake or Persona 5 Royal. I really hope it doesn't. Because honestly, that would... That would honestly upset me. Like, I would actually... I would actually be upset if that happened. But I don't think it will. At least the FF7 remake, I would say it's safe. I hope. I mean, I could technically get the game online, but I already pre-ordered it at GameStop, so, like, that's why I would rather pick it up, of course, because I paid for it. 
I got the deluxe edition, so I really hope it doesn't affect that. I guess we'll just see what happens, though. We must always give it our best. That wasn't. All right, I'm gonna see if I can find what this in request is. I'm assuming you just um, I don't know if it's a side quest, like you have to talk to someone or you have to find something on the floor. I don't know. Magical scarf for Pascal, I would guess. Also, something that really sucks is um. Actually, I like the iron stance. I'm gonna equip that. Um, something that really sucks is that there's no turtles transport because obviously there's no life. All there is is humanoids. There's no turtles transport, which really sucks. Secret fort, huh? Oh, tofu, cool. This looks like a fort a child would build. When I was little, I made these all the time. I set up anti-personnel traps and ran from my sister, and then was off. You must have been an incredible kid. This world used to be home to a great many people. Many oh, did it? Exceptionally gifted, just as Pascal here. But the monsters created by Lambda triggered a massive war, and now you see what our world has become. You know, I'll admit it now, but I was kind of worried that maybe it was the Amarcians who ruined everything. I bet you're pretty relieved that wasn't the case. Indeed, the fault for this lies with Lambda alone. Yeah, I guess it does. This place used to be with life, huh? You know, it's a little hard to believe, of course, after seeing this, but I guess I could somewhat believe it. It does seem a little odd that it, 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 it looks like it always is deserted. I guess the fact that it's like some, it like used to have life is, um, I can see it in a way. All right, I'm going to see region 66, see if I can find what I need. Oh my god, so many skits. I've been thinking about Affinia as of late. We have no way of knowing how things are progressing there. It's pretty stressy, huh? Can you use Poisson's communication device to contact anyone? I find it unlikely that a bird could fly all the way to our world. Well, let's just see. Off you go, birdie. And? It came back. I don't think this will work. Then, I guess it's the reinforced shuttle, or nothing, if we want to return. That time is already upon us. We should hurry. Yeah. You okay? Yeah, cool. I'm gonna fight this thing, actually. Then I'm gonna start skipping them. Hey, Arts, huh? Ego die is probably your weakness. Because it's a- Oh, it's not an aerial attack? Dragon dashes into the dragon art. Pretty obvious. That's actually a lot of HP for a regular enemy. Can I link? Oh, no power yet, huh? I mean, that's a lot of, um, CC it takes. I know this. Keep getting those um, fearful storm usages. Good job, Pascal. Blood Flame's always good, I guess. These things have too much HP for enemies compared to the damage I do. What, uh, what do I know? I'll get the piercing blast. Oh, okay, good. Yeah, it takes too long, honestly. I actually want to do that. 
Anyway, now I'm gonna start skipping the enemies just to um find the in request I have to do. I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna come back to region 66, so I'll fight them then. Earthen pot. I'll take it. Ancient cloth. I don't know who that would be for. Maybe um yeah, I actually don't know. Who would ancient cloth be for? Oh, for Sharia. I kind of like the casting speed near death. This just boosts her stats a little bit, so. As I said, I think it's better to have the bonuses that actually are useful rather than stat bonuses. Because you could do that through, through, through. You could you can do that through dualizing. Wait, that was like a slip off the tongue. That was like a tongue twister, what I just said. Get away from me! Thank you. Just trying to figure out where this in request is completed. And getting all the treasure. NATO, it's probably something for cooking. Amazing bone. Pretty cool also. Did I get gauntlet blitz yet? No, I did not. I barely did any fights, so not surprised. Gold is always nice. Emperor's Claw. I have a lot of gold. I'm definitely going to want to save that. Because there is something you're going to need gold for. A side quest I'm thinking of right now. You need like, I think it's 150,000 gold. So it's good to have that while we do. It's good to keep saving that up. Oh wow, there's actually a lot to explore in this region. These regions are a lot, like, more open world than the rest of the game's areas. Uh, am I the only one finding it hard to breathe? You've been under constant pressure since we came to this world. Maybe looking at those flowers would re- Huh? What is it? Those aren't real flowers. They're just made out of clay. No, Sharia. Those are real flowers. What? Huh? It is true. When they lost their Elith, they transformed into that clay-like substance. Lost their Elith? You mentioned some difficulty breathing. The disappearance of Elith is the cause of that as well. Very soon, this world will be completely dead. That can't be. The world will die? Yes, the Elith that springs from the planet's core has run dry. That is so sad. I feel bad for this place. I mean, there's the only sign of life in this place is um the humanoids, like Psy, the one fixing our shuttle, and Emerald. Emerald was like asleep for so long or something. I don't know. Oh, BRs are weak. Nice. Okay, cool. I wish I can combo better with Sophie. It feels like I can't really get much power hits. I just want my gauntlet blitz so I can get some good combos. Okay, let me see if I can help with the reviving. The Sherry uh, is hopeless. Sometimes. That's more the AI though. The AI Sherry is hopeless. Is what I mean. Sherry doesn't come in handy at certain times. She's fun to play, but like, as a healer, like AI, there are better healers in Tales of games. There are better um, AI healers, I would say. Sophie's a better AI than Sherry. Look at like the scenery, like the way the camera angles change. Oh, that's probably it. The way the camera angles change, like when you're walking up, that's really cool. Now, should I go back now? Maybe I should go back after when I get back to Telesas too, because this is quite a walk. This was quite a trip. So I think I should probably go back whenever I go back to Telesas too, which is going to be after this. Because this is a, this was a trip.